guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys something very insane. Now if I just kind of turn around, we have some massive robots in Minecraft Pocket Edition which can actually like walk and uh, shoot out TNT and all this crazy stuff. So if you guys want to try this map out for yourself, I will leave a link in the description below. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, go ahead and drop a like. So let's go ahead and begin, but before we do, we have to read a few signs, but guys, look at all of the robots right there. I cannot wait to just use them. So uh, it says, working slime block robots and MCPE. I didn't remove the sticky pistons as I did with the samples. So um, these right here. Oh, okay. Uh, so the creator is Bob the Creeper. The engine is modified by Derpy Jones, a slime block robot, movable TNT cannon design. Ooh, I like the sound of that. So they've given us some kind of instructions right here, which I'm not going to use, but you guys can if you really want to. So it just says like to shoot, place a redstone block or redstone torch, blow the piston, and then remove it so the robot uh, won't break. Also, do not activate it while the robot is active or moving. So, um, yeah, we can, you know, do that if we really want to, but I'm just going to leave it as now. What does this say right here? A missile launcher. Oh, okay. I like the sound of that, but we're going to go right here. So we can either use the flint and steel or like a redstone block, which, uh, it doesn't really matter, I don't think. So let's just use it right here and then remove it. And actually, I used the wrong one. <laughs> I completely did the wrong one. It is this. So we go like that and then remove it. And there we go. As you can see, it's now walking. We have a walking giant robot in Minecraft Pogdition. And that is just this one right here. We have all the other ones that we have to go over as well. So I think it does eventually stop. I'm not too sure, but that's the first robot. Very simple design. I mean, not really simple. I mean, if I was to try and, you know, build this, I, would, I might, you know, fail. <laughs> I can only build a simple robot. Nothing like this. Nothing advanced. Now, if we want to stop this robot, we can place obsidian, and I think we just place it right here. So, uh, right there. Let's see, does it stop? Okay, as you can see, it now stopped, and of course, it starts to rain, so let's just quickly change that. So, I'm actually um, recording on Windows 10 once again, so it is still technically MCPE, but just on the PC version. So, it's not Minecraft PC, so don't get confused. You can try this on Android, iOS, all of that stuff, because it is MCPE. So... We can, you know, remove this obsidian block, and if we want to try it again, we can use the flint and steel, and then just go like that, and it's going to move once again. Now, I'm not too sure if these are meant to shoot right here. I think it's meant to, but, um, I think I might have done something wrong. I'm not sure. <laughs> so, let's just quickly stop this, uh, so put it right here. Okay, let's just wait for it to go. There we go. Okay, so let's try the next one. Look at this. Looks like it has some kind of pistol right there, so... We're going to activate this, which the thingy is right here. Okay, so let's just... Um, okay, wait. What does it say right here? So it says... Oh, okay, wait. Can I get in there? There we go. <laughs> so it says uh, cockpit. So I think we might need to just activate it right here. So let's see if that works. Okay, look at this. So, oh, okay, the TNT just shot out. But this one doesn't. Now, I'm not too sure if I'm doing something wrong... But, um, yeah, I mean, it's still pretty cool. It's still shooting out the TNT, and it's just hitting it right on time. So that might have taken a lot of time to kind of get the hang of that, because imagine the TNT just drops down and just explodes your uh, robot. But this one is looking pretty good, but this one isn't shooting out. Now, I'm not exactly sure why it's not. I'm not sure if I'm meant to activate it somehow, but, I mean, it's still pretty cool. Okay, it's walking. Is it going to stop eventually? I'm not too sure because it can't obviously... Oh wait, no, it can. It can actually walk across this because it can just like kind of float in midair, I'm pretty sure. So let's see what it does. Um, What's it going to do? Oh, okay. Is it just going to like float? Oh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Look at that. It is walking on like nothing. Just no blocks here and it's still able to walk across it. That's a little bit weird. Now, how do we stop this machine? I have no idea. Where is the part where I put the obsidian? Um, oh, okay, it might be right here. Okay, let's put it right there. Now, did I stuff it up? Um, oh, okay, I stopped it. <laughs> Good stuff. All right, let's move over to the next one, which kind of looks like a dinosaur. Look how cool that looks. So let's see what these signs say right here. 
So it requires one pilot in survival, a rocket, um, okay, category two. All right, so it says missile launches above pistons facing upwards, okay. And this is how we're gonna activate it right here. We can do this and then remove it. There we go, and look at this, guys. It is now moving. Now, I'm not sure how we can activate the launcher. Uh, it did say something about the pistons facing upwards, which is this area right here. So I'm guessing maybe that? Did that activate it or did I just stuff it up? No, it's still moving, but it's just not shooting out. So let's try the next one. Ooh, look at this. I like this one. Let's see what it says right here. So it requires one pilot. Okay. Two missiles, one double TNT launcher. Okay, uh, that sounds pretty cool. So we can activate it right here, but I'm just not sure how you activate this stuff. I'm not sure if I'm doing something wrong, but let's just activate it like that. And is it going to shoot out anything? No oh, okay, it shot out this. Pretty cool. But I'm pretty sure it's, you know, supposed to do something here, but it's just not doing it. It is just not doing it for me. Uh, but yeah, we got some TNTs shooting out from the front, and then it's just, you know, whacking it in front of it, and then it's going to explode. Let's see if I can put, like, a pig down, see if it can, like, kill it or something like that. So, let's just place some pigs right where the TNT is getting launched, and... Oh, it killed the pig. <laughs> that is so cool. Alright, let's, let's get the pigs there again, and... Ooh, look at that. So cool. That is awesome. So, if anything's in its way, it is going to demolish it. Uh, very nice. I like that one as well. Let's try the next one, uh, which I believe... Okay, so I'm not sure why it says this here. I don't really understand it, but we activate it right here, I believe. So there we go. It is now moving. TNT is going to shoot out from both sides, but not from above. I I'm pretty sure it's meant to, but... I don't know. It might be for the looks, or it is actually meant to shoot out. I think it is, because what does it say right here? It says two missiles and two double TNT launches. So these are the two missiles, I'm pretty sure, right here. But it's shooting out from the left and the right side. So we can place some pigs down once again and see if they demolish it. Oh, they don't have a chance. They don't have a chance at all. Look at that. It just keeps killing it. <laughs> so these guys are still moving. Oh my goodness, they move a little bit slow. But this one is just... Um, it might eventually stop. I'm not sure. But let's try the final one, which is a massive giant robot as well. All of these are pretty giant, so let's see. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> didn't mean to drop that. So I just went and did this again now. I'm pretty sure to activate this thing right here, we just have to go like that and then remove it. And there we go. So it says to not do this while it's moving. So I just read it over there and um, yeah, so that's pretty much how that works. But now, it's just gonna keep on going. So, um, yeah. So that's how we can activate this one. Now, how do we activate this? Let's see. Um, let's see. Right here, I'm pretty sure if we go like this, and then remove it. Nope, okay, that's the wrong one. <laughs> okay, I'm not sure how you can activate this one because it's meant to be directly under. So maybe if I get a block of like grass or something, and then just go like this, and go like that okay look at that there we go so this one is now taking off <laughs> and it's not gonna stop i don't think so let's try these ones right here as well so as you can see the right underneath if we go like that and then this one as well so there we go as you can see it is now taking off and then of course we can you know activate it right here there we go so i mean it it's okay, I, um, it's a little bit confusing in a way. I think I just like it how it just shoots normally, just like that. I think that's a lot more better than just seeing these things just take off. So <laughs> it's still a very, very cool um, thing, I guess, for these robots. So let's try this one right here. So, oh, there we go. Place that there and then place this one as well. And then we can activate it, which is this. There we go. So look at that. <laughs> They're just moving along. Um, and this one's going to be insane. So this is the last one that I stuffed up on. But I'm pretty sure... See, we can't place it right there. Okay, we're just going to make this one move. Uh, which is... Where is it? Where do we activate it? Okay, right here. So boom, there we go. And this giant robot is going to start shooting out. 
all of this stuff here and these ones are just taken off but yeah that's pretty much how you can activate it I'm pretty sure I did that right uh, <laughs> so this one is probably my favorite one I'm not too sure there's a lot of robots to choose from I think that dinosaur one over there is pretty cool as well so let me know in the comment section below which one is your favorite one and why is it this one just because of the size of it and you know the amount of TNT that's coming out of it that's probably the reason why <laughs> this one is my favorite so look at that this one isn't stuffing up now and we can activate this one again so let's go like that and okay this one is that just stuffed up okay never mind we can't activate that one <laughs> and they look like it stopped right here now this one is still moving this one is still going this one's like the furthest one so far so i'm not too sure why this one's still moving but these ones stopped i think it might have been because i got out of its uh distance or something like that I'm not too sure like the update block like if i was to stay away from this one it's going to eventually stop i think i'm pretty sure how that works yeah look at that as you can see it now stopped and that TNT just dropped down and um oh my goodness <laughs> was that supposed to happen I'm not too sure these ones didn't do that but hey I mean this this map is still pretty cool this one is probably like my second favorite one and then yeah it pretty much goes from this one's my last favorite one my least favorite one because you know it's just a little bit basic I mean, trying to build this would take a long time. So that's pretty much it for these giant working robots in Minecraft Pocket Edition. Definitely go ahead and check it out for yourself. The link will be in the description below. Guys, these things are just so detailed. It's honestly ridiculous how these things work in Minecraft, but I like it. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. See ya.